Hello and welcome to a short tip video from New Jazz. We will talk about the very consonant characteristics of the Dorian mode. Have you ever been thinking that the Dorian mode sounds very consonant and pleasant? Listen. In this video, we will seek the theoretic reason why the Dorian mode is a very consonant mode. Now, let us pick the Dorian tonality C. So, here we have our Dorian scale. Next step is to construct the expanded Dorian chord from the keynote C. So we create a C minor, 7th, 9th, 11th, 13th chord. This huge Dorian tonic chord contains all the Dorian notes. Let me show you. I just take all my notes in the right hand and move them down an octave and the scale is complete. Let me spread out the chord again. This Dorian chord has some very special qualities because it is this very chord that provides the Dorian mode with its pleasant and consonant sound. So Let's take a closer look at this Dorian chord. Why does it provide us with such a pleasant and consonant sound? Well, it happens that the chord is built up with only perfect fifths merged into each other. Let me show you. Starting from the root, we have C to G, perfect fifth, E flat to B flat, perfect fifth, G to D, perfect fifth, B flat to F, perfect fifth, D to A, perfect fifth, and finally F to C, also a perfect fifth. And we are back home at the tonic C. What happened here? Well, we just walked through the entire expanded Dorian minor 13 chord from the root C without hitting a single tritone interval. All the fifths are perfect. Is there any other type of expanded chord where we can do that? I really don't think so. But if I'm wrong, please give me a comment on that. So, my theory is that the reason why the Dorian mode sounds very consonant is because of all the consonant perfect fifths merged inside the Dorian chord. Now, let me try to improvise a little consonant Dorian solo. Now I'm just trying to play a arpeggio on the Dorian chord. In this way, I'm emphasizing the consonant and pleasant sound. Well, of course, we can also play the Dorian scale more stepwise, and in this way, we can make some dissonant clashes. But still, when hearing the Dorian for some time, the super consonant Dorian chord will in a certain degree always shine through. This grid of perfect fifths is difficult to avoid hearing because it is the very root chord of the Dorian mode. And it is a chord with a composition that is very simple, plain, consonant, clear, well-defined and ordered. So, that's Dorian. Okay, 
this short tip video must have an end. So, thanks for listening. In the more comprehensive theory lessons from New Jazz, you can learn a lot more about the Dorian scale. I will paste some relevant links in the description below. Cheers from Oliver Prehn and have fun with the Dorian mode.